just off Interstate 95 in Colonial Heights, Virginia, resides the Keystone Tractor Works. With an amazing 90,000 square foot showroom, it's home to one of the largest collections of tractors and farm memorabilia in the country. We have pretty rare tractors in here. We have uh, a full collection of the John Deere, of the 28 models. We have one of each of those, and we have a lot of the smaller companies that have gone out of business, like the uh, stuff with Sears and uh, Montgomery Ward tractors and things like that. The catalog company sold tractors back in the day. We have quite a few of those, and uh, all of the major brands. We have some. Some of the rare ones, like the orchards and the hat crop tractors, which you don't see a lot of. Rare indeed. The Waterloo Boy is John Deere's first model from 1918, not to mention models from Case and Moline from the same era. And wear your sneakers because the collection is massive, but not all tractors are created equal. We have some small implement tractors used for cultivating small farms and like vegetable farms and small gardens. We have some of the high crop tractors that we use mainly down south like for sugar cane and taller vegetable crops. Then we have the Wheatland versions where we've been pulling big implements out in the Midwest and big fields. Stone says just like today, buying a tractor was not a trivial purchase for a farmer. Well the tractor all together was very, I mean it was one of the biggest purchases some of the farmers would ever make. It was on like buying a home uh, and most of them couldn't afford them back in the days and then you know when they did it they took good care of them they you know it was a, a pride possession to have a tractor you know you were the talk of the neighborhood when you got a new tractor on the farm people would actually come see you come see it the collection is more than just tractors you can check out tobacco lithographs from the 1870s or tobacco cans and pouches from the 1920s or wonder at the antique cars motorcycles fire engines and road tractors anybody can enjoy it here um, all kids love tractors you know, every kid just lights up when they come in we have one tractor they can sit on and get their picture taken with and uh, they all love it a 1600 piece collection of toy trucks and lots of country store memorabilia are also here. Stone says you have to see the collection to appreciate it, and he enjoys greeting visitors from far and wide. Some of the kindest people in the whole world come through these doors here. Some of the greatest people has ever walked this country and done anything around it were the farm people. I mean, it's, to, to me, it's, it doesn't get any better. I mean, they, they built this country. That's what uh, we were all about years ago. The museum has special events all the time, so check their calendar at their website, keystonetractorworks.com. In Colonial Heights, Virginia, I'm Norm Hyde.